by sickness? Haunted by your own looming mortality? Not anymore. Now there's Icarite, a technological miracle that lets us transfer consciousness from one body to another. That's right, humanity's wildest dream has been fulfilled. The dream of immortality. Now, when sickness or old age starts dragging you down, you can bid on a brand new body at your local government auction house. Give yourself and your loved ones a new lease on life. And don't forget, the body subscription service is mandatory for all citizens 21 and older. So protect your investment. Always avoid illicit substances. Never skip any mandated shell inspections. And prioritize your well-being, physical, psychological, and especially financial. Any lapse subscription payments will result in your body being submitted to a bailiff auction. And remember, any and all violations will be prosecuted by the Department of Mortality. Don't you already know who the murderer is? That's not the point. And at least tell me what's going on. Just watch, okay? This is the best part, where he's questioning the suspect. And when are you gonna question me? Do you want me to question you? Don't you want to? <laughs> Should I handcuff you? We always uh, handcuff suspects. I think you'd better. Sounds dangerous. I'm always dangerous. Too bad you didn't warn me before we got married. Would that have changed your mind? What if it had? Where do you think we'd be now? I don't know. Maybe I... maybe I wouldn't have. Huh? Prohibition violation at intersection of U Breaking news. The president today signed into law a controversial bill reducing the age limit for free body subscriptions, despite earlier promises to the contrary. Fucking politics. Sullivan, saved my ass more than once. Kara, how you feeling? Ready to get back in the saddle, Chief. I uh, sent you the papers. Oh, I know. I'm looking at them. Can you hear this? Fuck! What are you... Don't tear them up! Fuck! The accident was barely two weeks ago. Look, the committee already thought you were a hot mess. Trying to come back this soon? That's just got him convinced. You know fucking medical miracle, James. Chief, we've been busting our humps in the same department for half a century. You know I know this fucking job like nobody else. And you know I've got your back, too. Come on, Chief. You gotta let me come back. My hands are tied. Officially. Yeah? So unofficially, I'm all ears. Political case. Discreet. I'm listening. You'd be doing a favor for a guy whose signature trumps every test and commission out there. Fuck yes! <laughs> uh, I owe you, Chief. Goddamn sick leave had me climbing the walls. Not another word or I'll change my mind. Also, without your sync tests, 
can't get you back in the system. So I'm gonna put you with a liaison officer. She'll be the one with full access. A babysitter? Fucking hell. You asked for it, Sunshine. Wait, I'll put her on. <clears throat> what the... if you could drown. But of course, drowning is forbidden. Blocked like any other exit from paradise. Kara? James? Kara? No, fuck that. No way. Forget it, Chief. You're already on the line. James. Sarah Kai. Sarah. James Kara. Let me go pull some strings. Back in a minute. He dropped us into some bullshit, didn't he? And I have such good stats up to now. Yeah, I'm fucking thrilled to be working with you, too. Uh, what can I say? Your reputation precedes you, especially after you fucked up half the city with that train. Well, I don't remember much about the accident. People tell me it was kind of a spectacle. You don't remember? So, what, you haven't synchronized yet? Chief Steiner trusts me. That ought to be good enough for you, too. Yeah, well, so did your partner, right? Uh, the one who ended up having to get their eco-right reconstructed? Okay, I'm back. Best friends now, right? Sorry, boss. Sarah, I've sent you all the authorizations. Forward the package to Karen. Look, you don't have to trust each other. Just report everything. Got it? Steiner out. All right, let's get the show on the road. I need the address of the nearest post office. Fine. Looks like TS-45-7. You're in Times Square? I have business here. Half the city's had business there lately, thanks to that new brothel. I am not in a brothel. <laughs> sure, and I totally believe you. Okay, playboy, go for the package. Platform 53D, Terminal 3. stretch for a fat promotion. I've been working my ass off, so I can't afford any mistakes right now. And, you know, you're sort of notorious for unconventional methods. Who? Me? Oh, come on. Everybody knows you don't give two greasy rat shits about regulations. The only thing I ask is that we act professionally, okay? I'm willing to give it a shot. No promises. Great. Better than nothing, I guess. That's the spirit. Five o'clock somewhere.
James Cara, 77112P. Police shipment. Additional verification required. Enter badge number. 984. No authorization. Shit. Sarah, I need access. Oh, right. Uh, enter my number. 116739. Thanks. 116739. Thank you. The package is on its way. We hope you enjoy it. <laughs> Second, I have to move my car. Will be automatically destroyed after reading. Select a section to read the files. Subject's name is Edward Green. Who? Hard to confuse this mug with anybody else. Okay, Green, Edward. Oh shit. Sarah? You okay? Shit. Shit! Oh, I'm reading up on Green. Holy fuck! You know who this guy is? Relax. This will be a routine job. <sighs> routine my ass. What are we supposed to do? Get in, pull the Icarite, and deliver it to the Consciousness Transmission Center. No sweat. You're telling me the Covenant Chief, the guy who used to be the Secretary of Health, his Icarite's just lying around in a dead body? Fucking hell! Why isn't this going through official channels? There's been a scandal. Keep his name out of the mud. You know what could happen if the Icarite of a guy like Green fell into the wrong hands? fewer people know about it, the better. The atmosphere's tense because of this bill to reduce free body subscriptions. Exactly. Look on the bright side. I'm betting Green's gratitude hits the gas on that dream promotion of yours. Where's his body? Fifth Avenue, top floor. Looks like it's Green's own apartment. You'll get a chance to see the wannabe Olympus with your own eyes. Wanna tag along? Uh, no. I'm not authorized for field work. I at the moment. So, what's the harm? No, I, um, I couldn't. That would be unprofessional. Especially on a case this important. Unprofessional, right. All right, I'm all up to speed. Then let's get on with it. Attention, documentation will be automatically destroyed. James, I, um, I know you're not reinstated yet, but... Have you recovered from the accident? Like, mentally, I mean? Thanks for the concern. But I've never felt better. I'll ping you when I get there. Car out. took this job. I'd take any job at that point, even though political cases fester like rust-laced wounds. I was off to hang out with high society, of which I always had a low opinion. Maybe because it consisted mostly of low people. At 
this altitude, the air was so clean that without a smoke, I was beginning to suffocate. Shit. James, camera. This was supposed to be an accident. Fuckers hanging from the last cherry tree. What do you mean the last? Like, last last? Mm-hmm. Let's pull the echo right and get out of here. There was a pool of lesser than gel underneath the floor, feeding that big tree. Whole thing went up like a stick of dynamite. Damn. He really got cooked, didn't he? Well, I'm still gonna need a photo for identification. I mean, it could be him. Could doesn't cut it. We have to be sure. Mm. This is guesswork, James. I won't identify him. Not officially. I have an idea. I mean, you won't like it. This is a federal case, James. And we're supposed to pull Green's Icarite, not someone's. Moving on to reconstruction. You've seen this. What? Some kind of anomaly. Who cares? It's green. Pull a zikarite and let's go. The Icarite's melted. So? That's his insurer's problem. Come on, let's go. Sarah. He's dead. What? Like, you mean final death dead? Sarah, listen. I've seen this before. Up close. Take a few deep breaths. Then we'll start looking for who did it. We have to report this. We have to. Anything beyond that? I, it's... I'm... I'm sorry. Mm -mm. Sarah, relax. You're not doing anything. Got it? not even here. <laughs> if only it were that simple. Omega code 112358. Suspected murder. The right side of the body is more heavily charred. The tree must have exploded after he'd been hanged. James. Stop doing this. It wasn't just a fire. I'll find the cause and we're out of here.
few points. Points? For what? This engine could push a car up past 120 miles per hour, running on gasoline, on the ground. You know, it's hard enough to imagine driving on the ground and all. Oh, 120? No, I called bullshit on that one. See, you're having a great time. Right. The main transformer's under the floor. Chief, it's impossible to work under these conditions. I don't want to hear another word out of your mouth. You're going to drop whatever shit you picked up. You're going to write a clean report about a tragic accident. Got me? Uh, you pronounced murder wrong. I'm not asking. Tell him. All he was supposed to do was hold Reeves in the right. End of story. Uh, can I can I get it on the record that I strongly advised against this course of action? I should have known better. I should have known you couldn't handle it. It's just an incorrect rule, I thought. Surely Kara can't buck up something that simple. I'm trying to tell you there's no incorrect to pull. Green's got oxidized. It's a homicide. And it's staring us in the face, like it or not. Now I can look into this and it's not our case. Write it up as a suicide. Oh, it's a suicide now. I thought it was an accident. You can call it a motherfucking ascension for all I care. Just get it off our books! Oh, I sit here and more it all stinks. It's not just Green's rotting corpse. That's what caused the explosion. It's getting more and more obvious why nobody wants to work with you. I'll look for any pre-explosion traces, then we're out of here. James, I wasn't born yesterday. You said that before, and I don't believe you. Okay, this is... It's starting to get interesting. Someone carved this date long ago. What's up with the snake? Mm, check the encyclopedia. Someone tried to smash that glass before the explosion. Cracked it and left a handprint. Stop it. James, you've got to stop this. doing oh you're finally paying attention great so now the question is did green try to crack open that plate with his own forehead or did somebody else use green's forehead like a ball peen hammer why can't we see the killer in the reconstruction he covered his tracks pretty damn skillfully so someone was here. Fucking hell. What? You gonna tattle to the chief again? Would you just let that drop already? What's done is done. No point in picking at it. Wait, wait, wait. We're not going to work like this. There's gotta be at least a baseline of trust here. 
Yeah, well, that's all well and good, except we're running out of time to figure out how the tree got set on fire. So, come on, chop chop. Shit, what happened? The fuse is just blue. What? Why? The reconstructor needs massive amounts of energy. Sometimes the limiter doesn't adjust to the environment and pop. Blown fuses. on the emergency lights. Well, I wonder what the chief would have to say about that. Don't thank me, and for fuck's sake, get a move on. Something went off here. Probably some kind of relic. To the best of friends, always auspicious winds. Green. That asshole had friends. Hard to believe. I'm getting a bad hit off this thing. I wonder which one's the best friend now. I wonder why a gift from Green is in his own home. Let's see what the patient has to say. Check something out for me, would you? I need to know about a drug called Prose of Life. Introduced in 2208. It's based on fluoxetine. An antidepressant. How long did Green get psychiatric treatment? Looks like he's officially been in therapy for 156 years. According to statistics, that's pretty much normal for people who've lived as long as he has. It'll be worth checking the file to see if he mentioned anything about a suicide. Match to Green's blood type. He was fighting with someone. Or he cut himself as he jumped. Sarah, think outside of the box. I can come up with obvious ideas myself. from there. If he cut himself on the railing, there should be blood on it. Someone must have pushed him. Trace of blood on the railing. So he didn't cut himself here. This is weird. Green's fingerprints are on the railing. So he was leaning against it? Looks that way. came from this side. They? Half of the reconstruction is inconsistent. Someone must have been messing with it. We don't have enough information to find the other one. How do you think this went down? Green gave up after the fight and did whatever the perpetrator told him to. I'm thinking he put the rope around his own neck and then destroyed his own Icarite. Well, in any case, Green didn't jump. Someone pushed him. Wait. There's a blood trail here. He must have gotten cut before the hanging. Do you have a UV lamp? You're aware that UV radiation causes skin cancer? James, are you afraid of UV lamps? Call it whatever you want. I'm just not a fan of melanoma, that's all. He was 
walking up these stairs. Unusual shape. Like he was lying here. He's talking to someone. More like he's begging for mercy. Another trace of blood. Hit it with the UV lamp. Must have been bleeding a lot. Well, look at that. The tracks connect. Deserved what he got? I do. And it still wasn't enough. Shit. Sounds like you hated his guts. <sighs> oh, please. He's got something on his clothes. Some kind of chemical? Huh. The reconstructor's coming up goose eggs on its composition. Must be rare as shit, then. It stretches across the floor. I'll switch to UV. Oh, now don't pretend you're not afraid of UV anymore. I am not afraid of the lamp. Only radiation. We're not discussing this. The tracks lead this way. Looks like Green is rummaging around the Transformer. Cables are torn out. Same as the one around Green's neck. You think he did it? I think someone made him do it. Exactly the way the perpetrator wanted it to. Seriously? You're repeating yourself. There's something here. James? <clears throat> I've lost visual. Crapper at home. You want more detail? Because I can give you more detail. Whatever. The feds are on their way there, so consider this a heads up. If they find you, I don't fucking know you. Are you... You're serious? We've been friends for fucking decades and you're gonna hang me out to dry? Hey. 
How's the situation? They're coming. Time to clean up. Sarah, if we're gonna keep working together, you're gonna have to promise me something. What? That you'll never do anything behind my back again. Are you fucking kidding me? Are we gonna pinky swear? Should I let you know every time I change a fucking tampon? James, the feds are coming. So, grow up- He was clearly trying to get rid of those. Didn't make it. Or someone stopped him. Better for them to disappear. That was evidence! For fuck's sake, James! Who do you think you are? What gives you the right to just do whatever you want to do? Hey, now. Don't be envious. Looks like a door. It must be opened remotely. Maybe I can find something with X-ray. I'm gonna leave a mess after all. Nobody will even know I was here. I leave the body of a dead god on the flaming Mount Olympus. Time to go back to the underworld he cast us all into. is nothing but trouble and heartache. And even worse, it's personal. A lit cigar pressed against a wound that never heals. That's me. The second time I've seen Icarite completely melted. Just when I got a little better at forgetting the first one. Seventh floor, yet the thick stench of piss soaked streets still fills the air.
Who's paying off your body, huh? I think I deserve some of this. Take your hands off me. was your day? Excellent. Only one corpse. I'm glad to hear that. Due to the high level of air pollution, I recommend full body decontamination. As usual. You're lucky I don't need to water you. Depend on me, and you won't have long to live. past. I feel like I'm taking them more and more often. marked by someone else's mistakes. Though for some reason, it's much easier with the eyes. Once the life fades out of them, they can belong to anyone. more space to fire up the evidence board. Sarah Kai, additional verification needed. Sarah, I was just thinking about you. James, you're not gonna believe it. Someone just tried to log into my account. Seriously? Who tried to pull a stunt like that? Oh, don't bullshit me, James. I figured you'd try and pull something like that. So much for pinky promises, huh? Sarah, listen. <laughs> to complete my report, I need to summarize the evidence. I need access to the system. You heard Chief Steiner. He wants it classified as a suicide and sent straight to him. Do you want to do this professionally or not? Kara, damn it. Don't try to sweet talk me. Do you think I don't know why the Chief put you on restricted duty? I read your wife's case file. 
You're gonna leave my wife out of this. Okay. Look, the fact that she committed suicide the same way affects your perception. She didn't commit- Fuck! Listen. Sooner or later, some egghead will read the report with your signature on it and ask one fundamental question. Who fucked it up like this? Well, you say then. That the chief told you to write it down as suicide? Or that the investigation was conducted by a cop on sick leave? Oh, fuck. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, you know what? Here's what we'll do. I have access, so I analyze, and I put the evidence on the board. Is that clear? As clear as day. Nobody talks like that anymore. Look, let's not fight. Let's connect the dots one by one. If we agree with the conclusions, we move on. You'll agree with me sooner or later. The sooner we get this over with, the sooner you can write the report. <laughs> That's the spirit. I should clear up Sarah's doubts about the murder. First, I have to prove that somebody else was there besides Green. And when Sarah takes the bait, I'll convince her about the rest. Somebody had to be pretty damn determined to fuck Green's Icarite up this bad. Somebody. Right. Could have been Green himself. He could have... And? We've got it! We can start somewhere. I was hoping for more enthusiasm. Not gonna happen. Ouch. Okay, we still have shit, but we can at least ask two questions. First, what's the actual cause of death? Second, Who's the culprit, and what's his motive? Are you saying you're getting involved? I've already changed my mind. Are you the same with guys? I won't correct you on everything you just said that was wrong. Besides, I'm looking for more information about the evidence. But seriously, no more jokes. Wanna guess which one's the best friend? Nope. I have to wonder if someone just dropped it here. Or if they threw it back in Green's face. I found some interesting tidbits. Please share. Only with friends. But I'll make an exception for you. Why did he go to so much trouble? To get past the police reconstructor? Oh, the sequence of events worries me. It'll be hard to defend the theory about these cables. The moment of the fall is puzzling. I want to say that someone kicked him, but we don't have enough... Apparently, he had a heavy foot. He was just showing off to a girl. If I had such a fancy car, I wouldn't need a girl for anything. What a weird shit. Let me guess. Some of these substances don't show up in the system. Yeah. How did you know? I'd say we're looking at an old-school cover-up. No. I don't think so. No. That would be... What? Unethical? Got something? Nah, it's nothing. We had guests. If that says what I think it says, we're getting somewhere. This is no proof. What? But a very solid hypothesis. <sighs> I agree. Let's move on. seen a shootout in the reconstruction. Hmm. Must have happened before. Maybe he shot someone? This is creepy. Ugh. Looking at this makes my skin crawl. <sighs> you don't want to know what it's doing to mine. If we knew how the perpetrator administered the poison. Hey! We can officially call it a poisoning now. Great! You want to open some champagne? Hang on. Do you actually have some champagne? Sure. Old basement full. Vintage from the mortal age. A 
This is creepy. Ugh, looking at this makes my skin crawl. You don't want to know what it's doing to mine. Look, you don't have to try to convince me that green is behind everything. Suit yourself. James, this is fun, and I'd play three more games of Solitaire, but it won't prove anything. What else do you need? More facts, or it's a waste of effort. We need to talk seriously. Is this some lame engagement joke? What? No, it's, it's not like that. I, I just have something for you. If it is, however, some stupid joke, I will get fucking mental on you. There is one more piece of evidence. Sorry? Why don't I know about it? It's not in the archive. Because it's not a photo. Oh, wait a minute. <sighs> Tell me you're joking. I'm begging you. It turns out I think it is indispensable. You took physical evidence from the crime scene? <sighs> They'll put us in jail for this! Oh, shit. I take it back. I'd rather have the engagement ring. It's beautiful. A vial of strange liquid. Probably poison. This creepy voodoo symbol on it makes it more mysterious. More importantly, the material of the vial might retain fingerprints. What do you think? Show me. If you have any more stolen evidence up your ass, you better get it out now, before you hurt yourself. Not this time. Consult your doctor. There's even a term for it. Kleptomania. Symptoms include paying for it someday. Your arm code? Nine, seven, fucking six. Around Liberty Island, huh? None of your business. Everything was in Sarah's hands now, which was neat since my own hands were shaking in a delirium I inherited after some punk I've never known. And one more thing, in the meantime, please send that damn report. What about evidence analysis? You got evidence illegally, and you want to put it in an official report? Let's hold off. I'd rather have a better view of the situation. We can decide later. Nobody sticks their head outside anymore. As if they wanted to believe this ugly world does not really exist. Huddled in their little flats over the few cents they managed to save towards a new body. Never asking themselves whether the survival instinct makes the urban rats happier. Or is this only the selfish genes? Free riding on the suffering of subsequent generations. Other alien forces exploiting their drive towards self-preservation. Their desperate struggle to stay alive a little longer. Desperate struggle that even Green is eventually lost. These people are probably easier to control, but Green? He was one of the controllers. The person who whacked him was no ordinary citizen either. No way. James, are you in front of the board? No, I went out for a breather. That sample, you were right. It's definitely poison, but that's not all. There was a fragment of a print on it. I managed to reconstruct it and search the database. So, who does the print belong to? It's a damn big fish. Slippery, too. Oh, 
You're gonna make me beg? What's the fucking name? I don't want to say right now. Somebody on the street might overhear. I sent you everything by snail mail. Let me know as soon as you get it. I'm having deja vu. snatched away from the citizens. I bet they're all celebrating. President, calm people down, promise to veto, and then what do you do? He signed as soon as the bill lays on his desk. Deadly poison is atropine. Okay, great. At part, it was Kovalev's fingerprint on the murder weapon, huh? I knew it. You still think we can't clear this one? I wouldn't start celebrating yet. We'll never get to him. He basically never steps outside Icarus. But you do believe this is a Special announcement. Engine problems have been reported aboard Icarus, which is currently flying over Brooklyn. We ask residents of the borough to stay at home and shelter in place. There is no need to worry. Insurance for bodily injuries will be fully applicable. James, did you hear the announcement? I even felt it. Are you that close to it? Are you all right? Uh, the news feed said it crashed into a building and that it's about to fall into a chasm. Yeah. We can't pass up a fucking golden opportunity like this. Pass up a gold? No, wait, James, are you crazy? Too late, bye! The bar was named Icarus and met its end fittingly. I didn't have time to savor the irony. An impossible chance to get Kovalev has just fallen.